Going into that first shift, you know, I was, I was kind of excited, but at the same time extremely nervous because, you know, you don't have that, that safety net there necessarily. Um, but all in all, I guess the day went, went pretty well. Um, went on quite a few calls, but nothing too out of the ordinary, too crazy. Um, so it was kind of a, I don't want to say laid back day, but it was a little easier than jumping into something crazy. Um, yeah, it was, I think it was 22 total weeks. Um, they do, and they do. There's three different steps, and then that last step is pretty much all on you. Um, and throughout the whole process, I mean, they're throwing anything they can at you. You're jumping on every call you can get on. Um, more or less, you're just trying to get on everything you can to try and get as much experience as you can. So when you get out on your own, you feel a lot more confident, um, which I guess that's kind of how I went through the program, was just jump on everything you could. Um, I, it definitely helped once I got out of the program. That first couple, those first couple of days, it was a little less nervous, but still pretty nervous. Um, just it's a lot, of, a lot of time, a lot of hard work, putting in a lot of effort, late nights. Um, it just it feels great to be finally on my own and be part of the team. Turn on my computer, get everything going, make sure the lights work, and then um, check the back seat do the things that need to be done right away. So if I got sent to a call right away, it's done. I don't have to worry about it. You know, just even getting a thank you. That goes a long way, especially in, you know, society today where the police are seen as bad people, more so than good. Um, just even a simple thank you goes as far, solving a case, uh, whether it's, you know, a petty theft all the way to a burglary or something to that effect um, because at the end of the day you're helping someone out um, whether they appreciate you know what you do or not they're still thankful for what you do and that to me that that goes a very long way yeah it, uh, it definitely feels good um, I've come a long way from uh, you know from the start of the Academy and to making it through the field training program and now being out on your own um, definitely see a lot of improvement in uh, my skills, and I'm sure Sam and Chaudet uh, does as well. Um, being a police officer, one of the jobs where you learn something new uh, every single day. I come to work and learn, you know, something new, something different happens. Uh, after 20 weeks of training in the field training program, uh, felt good just to be able to sit in the car by yourself, have your bag next to you. Um, but it was definitely. I was definitely nervous at the same time because you're in, you know, you're in control. You, you know, you kind of run the show and do what you want. Um, you know, respond to calls. You don't have someone looking over you all the time and making sure you're doing it right. Um, you know, it's a, it's up to you at that point. Um, you know, to manage the calls and stuff. Um, but so so far, uh, being on my own, I think it's went really well. You know, in the program, you get a variety of calls and you know whether it's you know arrest or. Um, accidents or you know whatever calls you need to do you feel pretty profici proficient in all of them and I think um, my field training officers help me out a lot um, as far as making sure I'm ready um, for when I get out on my own um, so I don't think I was nervous in that regard.